previously on the Sith Warrior playthrough. You must proceed to your next trial immediately. I want you to interrogate three prisoners in the Academy jails and decide their fates. Consider each criminal's story carefully. The decisions you make will be scrutinized, so let your passions guide your judgments. I will handle it. Go to the Academy prison. Speak to Head Jailer Nash and return to me after you pass judgment on the prison. <laughs> Hey yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to our Sith Warrior uh, Coleman Hill uh, because we'll be uh, doing this <laughs> with this word, whatever, we're doing this playthrough. Um, so we're supposed to speak to Jailer Nash and Overseer Rance. So let's go speak to uh, the Overseer. Uh, and get some abilities trained up before we go um, question people and figure out and determine their fate. So, yay. You are strong, but you could be stronger. Show no mercy. And it, it does seem like uh, modded gear is somewhat better than the normal gear. Because uh, on the bounty hunter that I'm messing around with right now, I just modded like all my gear and bought uh, the accessories off the GTN. Those can get kind of expensive really fast. But um, is this the right place? Yes, it is. Okay, here we are. Here we are. But uh, yeah, so that's what we'll be doing with this guy. One more cheer from you, little bird, and you'll regret it. Chirp, chirp, chirp. Jerk! If you don't like that, just say so. I can do other animals too. Dire cat, frog dog, quaking monkey lizard, you name it. You, I'm Jalen Nash. I run these cells in slave pits. You're the acolyte Tremel sent for the test, right? <laughs> he thinks highly of you. And then I will repay his faith by sticking to my mission. You should know this situation is highly unusual. Normally an acolyte goes off will for the interrogation. Overseer Tremel had these three shipped in for you. Just for me, huh? He thinks you're the next coming of Exar Kun. But you ought to know, Tremel ain't the only one paying attention to you. Now, these three prisoners have been transferred here for your inspection. You gotta interrogate them as needed, and then decide their fate. The convicted are usually executed, or given a trial by combat to see if they're worthy. Whatever you decide, you will be the one to carry out the sentence. I was hoping this would keep me entertained. Ah, fine. Let's get started. This one on the left. You freaks aren't getting anything new out of me. Just do whatever you're gonna do. Hmm. You can either talk to me or to the Inquisitors. And I promise, I have a much sunnier disposition. Get lost. I've been through this routine. I already know all your Inquisitors by name. Impudent to the last. As I was saying, she was sent to kill an Imperial spy in the Yavin system. Throughout her torture, she maintained that she was hired anonymously. Get it through your damn head! I had no idea he was Imperial, and I don't know who hired me. Regale me with the details of your operation. What was your chosen form of murder? I didn't kill him. I was caught before I could pull it off. The point is, she doesn't deny the charge. So now you must decide. Execution or trial by combat? Which do you choose? Yes, so I know all of the right answers. And so I'm going to pick all the right answers. That's just Neither the right way to go. She could prove useful. Send her to Imperial Intelligence. I won't work for free. Huh. You spared her. Interesting. Please, I am a fellow Sith. Judge me with an open mind and grant me trial by combat, I beg you. Your name, now. This part of Waste is Dabotech. Once a valued Sith champion, until he botched an important mission and caused a thousand Imperial deaths. Now look at him. I served faithfully for 24 years. Then one mistake, and they threw me away. Now I have been left here to rot. Please, let me feel the weight of a weapon once more. I don't do charity work. Feel the weight of a weapon in your throat. 
yeah. I die a disgrace. That's not even a weapon, bruh. What? That's a force joke with a nice cool effect. Oh. Spoke too soon, apparently. Good. I won't have to look at his sad weathered face anymore. Thank you. Don't mention it. Ah, well, this last prisoner's a bit of a puzzle. He's called Bregg, and he's a jittery little wretch, suspected of supplying forged documents to Republic agents. Strangely enough, he maintains his innocence, despite being severely tortured. Nebaga imana, naki naya, bila magnam unya kamna lebek. Come on, who would go to all the trouble of setting you up? Nibikak nakamak. Nebaga imana, naki naya, bila magnam unya kamna lebek. Ah, he's never wavered from that line. And the evidence is circumstantial. I suppose it's actually possible he didn't do it. So, what do you decide? Okay, so this is actually funny, because I actually don't know. Okay, so I know it's not set him free. I just don't know if I'm supposed to leave him or kill him. I just don't know the, I don't know that one. I think I'm just going to kill him, play it safe. I don't care if he's innocent or not. Torture him enough and he'll confess. Oh, wait. Different one. Huh. I thought that was kill him. Huh. Whatever. Shut up, you fidgety fool. The decision's been made. Guess we should have left him. <sighs> well, that's sad. You're an interesting one, kid. I can see why people are keeping tabs on you. Head back to Overseer Tremel. See what he thinks of your choices. Well... Kind of messed up on Bregg. Should have just left him locked up. Unless that is the right choice. We'll have to see. I'm not really sure. I know the other two are the right ones. But I don't know about him. But okay, cool. So we've got some new abilities we won't really get to use today. Because we're not fighting anyone. But uh, yeah, I guess this was going to be sort of quick, huh? Wasn't I forgot that this was going to be super fast. But whatever. Nice, quick, and easy episode. That that scared me. I can't. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> All right, here we go. Story area. Who is that guy? Is this everything? Everything Lord Renning was able to obtain. Yes. Then run back to your master in the beast pens before I cut you in half. Sorry to make you wait, acolyte. These interruptions are incredibly annoying. On to the business at hand, your test in the jails. First, the assassin, Solenz. She attempted to kill an Imperial spy, but was unaware of her client's affiliation. You assigned her to Imperial intelligence. I commend you, that was excellent thinking. Never waste a potential resource. Thank you, Overseer. I'm glad you approve. What's more important is that Darth Barris would approve. Now, Devotech, the former warrior. He wanted combat, but you struck him down. Perfect. The man was utterly useless. I took no pleasure in killing him. And why would you? It's like taking out the trash. You just do it. You don't think about it. Once something is used up, it should be eradicated. Lastly, the forger you sent back for more torture, even though he seemed innocent. A strong decision. Leave no stone unturned. I did it! It was the right one! <laughs> And what if it turns out he truly is innocent? It's always best to know beyond any doubt. After all, what is one man's sanity or life versus the fate of the Empire? Hmm. Each time, each prisoner, you made the best possible decision. You may yet be able to challenge Vemrin for Darth Barris's attention. To celebrate? A small reward. Thank you very much, Overseer. Thank yourself, Acolyte. It's performances like this that might just beat the extreme odds we're facing. Because I forced you into the Academy ahead of schedule, Darth Barris will be predisposed to judging you severely. And by severely, I mean fatally. Now, we must hurry to your next trial. Every moment that passes, we risk discovery before we're ready. In the caverns of Mark Aragnos is the beast he left to guard his legacy. Go there. Sit among the flames and wait for the beast to come for you. 
Sounds like a good opportunity for violence. Holds nothing back. This creature is doom itself. Return to the Valley of the Dark Lords and find the tomb of Marka Ragnos. I'll see you when the beast is slain. Good luck. Alrighty then. I guess that's going to be it for today. Because we've leveled up, like, what, twice now? Twice today. Let's go. Good work, everybody. Thank you all so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you're new, consider subscribing. If not, thanks for watching. And peace. <laughs>